Yo, what's going on guys? Rapid Plays here, and okay. First things first, right? So, yes, I know I was absent from recording yesterday. Don't get mad at me, okay? There is a very sound reason for that. And my very sound reason is I was home extremely late yesterday. Um, by the time I got home, I, I was so tired that I pretty much just went straight to bed. It was bad. Like, really, really bad with how tired I was. So, that's why I took, that's why you guys did not get an upload yesterday. Um, so, sorry for that first. Second thing, um, yeah, we're just, we're just here, man. We're just trying to survive right now. Uh, yeah, my brain's just kind of passing away. It's kind of hot in my room. It's hot where I live. And, uh, we're not turning on the AC yet in our house. So, naturally, I am just sitting here sweating my absolute nads off. And it's fun. It's fun. It's just a great old time, you know? Just just an absolutely wonderful time. But yeah, you guys made it. It's Friday. Hope you guys are going to have a great weekend. Um, my weekend is going to be pretty pretty interesting, to say the least. Um, going to be gone a lot from home this weekend but you guys will still be getting uploads on saturday and sunday so uh round of applause for that round of applause for that but yeah let's uh let's just continue let's just continue pushing forward here all right so what are we thinking here add an extra clan rent unit to the army spawn under sure I didn't even know that there's armies that spawn in under city, so I'm gonna keep it a buck. Let's take what should be I seriously ours. did not even know that. Hmm. 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 I don't know. I don't know what to do Where here. Um. Obviously, we could push forward, which wouldn't be that bad of an idea go and take this settlement which i'm actually probably gonna end up doing here oh, let's start that let's we'll just move right to the edge of our territory now, now. so the next turn we can oh, wait no oh the dwarves are all the way up here this is their last settlement hmm, never mind okay Eyes ready. well i guess we have an under thing and the uh in these guys's thing under city so, whatever. It works. <laughs> it works. Uh, man, the elves hate us. And the elves are very strong. Hmm, not very good. Not very good at all. Um, what do we do next here? Because, I mean, yeah, we could go down here and attack Phyrus. Uh, they are a Bretonia faction. Like, we could push across here, but this... I feel like this wouldn't be the best move to push across the street and attack the people here. I just don't think that would be the smartest of moves for us right now. Just like our positioning and stuff, I don't think would be the best for it. So I think we just continue to wage war up here. Um, yeah, no, I, I, don't, I don't really know. I do not really know. Alright, uh, let's get this guy moving. Get this guy moving down there. I did remember about that. Building upgrade available. That's not really an upgrade. Is it? What does this do? Ooh, that's actually kind of sick. That's actually kind of nice. Even though it's probably one of the least expensive buildings I could get, uh, that little bit is pretty good. So. Yeah, I don't know what to do yet with the strategy. Um, cause we have we have a lot of ground to cover still. By a lot of cover, ugh. and by a lot of ground to cover. My goodness, my English is. It's just not doing good right now. We're just struggling. We are just absolutely struggling. But anyways, what I was gonna say is I'm just not really sure what I'm gonna do right now because. There's many ways that we could go about what we're about to do. There's many, many different things that we could do. So, let's see here. Um, 
All right, let's just go back there and do like, what's this? Sure. That one only takes one turn, so I'll do it. This can be upgraded. This can also be upgraded. Beautiful. And you can upgrade something in here. You can just build something in here. Um, I might build this just to get our, just be able to re-recruit units a lot faster. Um, <laughs> this guy has an upgrade. We're going to go. Hmm. Ballistics calibration. I think that one sounds pretty sick. And then we're gonna head up here to try to finish off the dwarves. Not possible. Oh, they have multiple places left. Never mind, that is not finishing them off. What do we do here? Because we could always attack like Fort Soul. What's that garrison look like? I know exactly where we are on the map, by the way. Like, I know what's up here and stuff. Because um, in a solo playthrough with Ty, I played as this faction that's right here, that human faction. So I kind of know where I am on the map right now. But I don't, I don't know what to do. Because like, what is this? Oh, they want us to take that. Hmm. Because we don't have any like allies that would help us in that fight. If that makes sense. The Goblin King. Fear the pirate queen. All his powers. Because yeah, like I said, we just don't have. We just don't have anything to really. I don't want to say to do, but if we go to war with the elves, we're gonna get our butts whooped. Like that's that's kind of a predetermined thing because that garrison is massive, and all the other elf factions will descend upon me. But I also don't want to start that war with the humans yet because these guys can cut cut us back from behind. Um, okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to start to move knife Master out of engineer. down here. This guy, when stretch gets, stretch will be the new army down here. Um, knife will be the re-garrison behind engineer. army. Yeah. That's what we're going to do. All right. All right. All right. I've got an idea. I've got an idea formulating in thy brain. We'll see how good of one it is or how bad of one it is, but it is still an idea formulated formulating in thy brain so yeah we'll just we'll just try our best to be smart about it because yeah no we just need to we just need to be smart about this because although we are a pretty powerful faction at the moment we can definitely be cut in half very fast right now we are very vulnerable to attack And I don't feel like being cut down. Um, that's actually probably not a bad thing to do. Because, <sighs> like, how do I put this? Do I have military access with these guys? I don't have military access with them. Mmm, that's kind of annoying. I'm not going to lie. Kind of makes me just want to kill them. <laughs> <laughs> kind of makes me just want to massacre them. So now, now you're starting to see why I don't have any allies, because I just kill all my allies. Um, and I don't really want to start a war with the elves. Because, like, just look at how powerful they are. Like, let's look at their strength rank compared to ours. What is our strength? 30. And theirs is... Oh, they're, they're 41. So the game thinks we can beat them. We should probably just get our other army up here with us for it. Is probably what it's saying. So let's keep this army moving here. Most masterful of masters. I order. you can barely move anywhere. That is no horrible. Weak. I need something to help with the uh, with the whole people not liking me over here thing. Our control level is not good. That's what's causing most of it. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. 
Um, I kind of just want to, like, teleport over here and just blink, just start blinking these settlements. Like, just tunnel up here. Which might not actually be that bad of an idea. Are they alliance up? Let me see here. Uh, defensive allies, they are. Defensive allies with each other. Oh, we need another Skaven faction so bad. Because, like, there's nothing we can do right now. It's irritating me a lot. Because I don't want to just go south, because that's just kind of leaving, like, the north up for grabs. You know what I mean? But, like, there's nothing else really to do other than start to go south. Okay, I'm going to blink this pirate faction. Um, Knife will take over in the north. So, here's what's going to happen. So, Ikiklaw is going to come down here, finish this pirate faction, and then we'll start attacking down here. Um, Knife is going to come up here and just sit and crack Boofdar as a kind of like a guarding army. Just being a good guarding army up there. And then Knife, I'll start to give him an army down here once he gets down. Or a stretch once he gets down there. That That's going to be what we're going to do. That's the idea of formulating in the brain. Just let me cook. Just let me cook. Just let the brain assemble because we are don't get me wrong we're struggling a little bit here to figure out who we want to go to war with and stuff but we're also not doing that bad so yeah i'm also hoping that the bloody hands can end up killing those guys the dwarves that'd be kind of sick Yeah, I would 100% attack the elves if they just didn't have the power that they do up there. With just being in an alliance and stuff as they are. Oh my goodness. We can build so much here. What does this give us? What are you? Flail infantry? Oh my god, that sounds sick. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's, let's look at all the available options here. Make sure we get the best one. Alright, so this just just makes our garrison absolutely insane. This one is... Okay, I have no clue how that would help us that much. Uh, this is just more like infantry artillery stuff. So we should probably get this, because this will give us... What does this give us in the end? Just some better infantry. Um, okay, we're going to get this, because that those guys look insane. We're also going to get the hounds, and then we don't really have enough money for anything else. So we can build. What can we still build here? <laughs> oh, bless me. Bless my face. Bless my snot. That was disgusting. Um, can I even still build? Oh that that does absolutely nothing for me <laughs> absolutely nothing all right it can call keep it moving big dog we got we got places to go man knife go here stretch give him the goods and then keep going south to margaritaville so you can get wasted and you'll go up to crack the car Okay, we're, you know what? We're getting there. We're cooking a little bit. See, you just gotta let my brain formulate. Just just a little bit. Just a little bit. Um, okay, okay, okay. We're getting there. We're getting there. I know this episode hasn't been very exciting so far, but it's one of those episodes where we kind of have to do all the small stuff. So, it kind of sucks, but again, not really too much we can do about it. Do, 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 do. Only 98 factions left in the game, which means that there's some very large factions starting to assemble. Very, very large factions. But yeah, we'll see. We'll see how everything goes here. God, 
I just I just want to kill those elves so bad because just because of how uh, how do I put this? Oh, Confederation. But yeah, just because of how strong they are all combined. I wish we like we could just take them out now. So we don't have to worry about them at all later. Uh, <laughs> do we already have one of those? Yeah, we do. Let's start getting a bunch of smaller stuff built out to some of these villages. Get them up to speed. Get cooking, boys. Look at look at the boy. Look at the absolute mad. Look at this guy. What an absolute mad lad. Look at him. Bro's just pumping it up back here. Look at him. You're going crazy. Wait, is that it could call on the that's it could call on the inside. That's just his slave back there. The life of a slave, I guess. Alright, knife. Keep going, big dog. We need you up here yesterday. Sorcerer inventor. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Where is this rogue army going? They are going cross country right now. Imagine they attack the lobby. That would make me cry. I don't even think we have a good garrison here. Oh, never mind. Well, they're not very good, but we have a garrison. We have a garrison, nonetheless. Okay. Okay. I don't, still don't think I can really build anything here. Alright, another end turn. You know, we are flying through turns right now. Absolutely screeching. What to do? I'm, I'm just like, I'm just thinking long term in this game. I'm trying to think of how the game's going to play it out and how I'm going to have to play it out to combat the game. Because the dwarves are obviously probably just getting stronger right now because I think the bloody hand is getting weaker at the moment. Which is making me a little bit nervous, I'm not going to lie. Because, like I said before, I don't want to get overextended. But at the same time... We only have two armies. So, like, realistically, how much can we expand before we are going to be over mine, mine. Do they have another city somewhere? There's no way, right? Like, the pirates only have Sartosa. If they have anything more than Sartosa, I'd be really surprised. And, because if so, I don't know where that is. Like, they have that. can't get anything yeah that's cool. i'm just pretty much making skaven blight uh going to be almost impossible to take in case like for some reason the series goes to absolute shite we can at least try to defend skaven blight to the end to the end for icket claw because you know our boy he's just chilling he's just chilling yeah stretch get in that settlement big dog w mans w mans Stretch is just out here doing stuff for us, you know? The boy's just out here cooking. The absolute mad lad Stretch himself. Okay. Let's see here. And it says the pirates are pretty strong, too. Which is... It's kind of confusing me. Just a little bit. But we'll see. We'll see. It's like, I just don't understand how they're that strong if they only have Sar Sargoza left. I just don't understand it. Like, they have to have more than just that now. No That's just what I'm trying to get my head around right now. Oh my god, this guy can actually get a pretty good army. But I just want to get clean rats. No, not slingers. Do we have any warp fire throwers? We don't have any warp fire throwers down here. Well, that's kind of crazy. Um, I guess we'll just recruit out his infantry. 
give him a bunch of clan rats. But yeah, I would have swore that they had more than inventor. Mouth full of urchin. Yeah, you're I understand that you're not gonna be very happy with me, but at the same time, like, you know, hold this, brother. <laughs> no Just hold this, brother. Um we have so much food, why not? We can occupy the level two seven. Look at that. And we got so much gold out of it. Look at that, 9k. Give me that, 9k. And that's big for us, because now look at them. Now look at them. This is all they have left right here. That's it. Right? That's it? Pirates. Their strength rank 47 still? Brother, where in the... Oh, right there, right in front of my face. They're in Gopher down here. They got a big I army in denied. Gopher. Hmm, this might be an issue. This might be an issue, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, knife, get up here so you can hold our front line up top. And then, yeah, I need you to get an army quickly in case we need to rush some help over. Knows who his boss is. Um, Get your stats up, G. <laughs> yeah, it could claw down here. I mean, bros, don't get me wrong, bros kind of cooking, but his his health is also kind of cooked. Um, we'll disband these guys so we can get those. There we go. Okay. Okay, we're doing good. Um, yeah, we're doing good. Who are they all at war with? They're at war with Leoness, us, and the Golden no. Order. Okay, so, and they're they're out of the picture. Golden Order is. What are you guys? Greenskins? Greenskins? Gosh dang it. I seriously can't find any Skaven factions anywhere. Like, where are all the Skaven factions at? I am looking all over the map, and I can't find anything. Virus might be a good place for us to start attack. To start our attack on. Um, can we make peace with the dwarves? That'd kind of make Lord, it. Only true vengeance <laughs> <will> <laughs> That's a negative. Um, you saw both those settlements, or is this just the one stuff? Saw them both. <sighs> very interesting. Very, very interesting. I wonder what the bloody hand guys are doing. That the that that's still a thing, you know? I'm like, I'm, I'm genuinely just kind of, I'm not, I don't want to say lost, but I'm like, what to do? Because like I just said, I'm, it's not like I'm lost or over where did the pirates go? Are they dead? They're not dead. Ready to sword fish. They don't have any settlements though. Oh, they have no settlements. Salt is that so? Delightful. Is that so? Then what do you have left? Oh, dwarves only got one left. And it's just crack hern. Beautiful. So the bloody hand guys are doing exactly what I wanted them to do. Um, let's check Scape and Blight out. We can upgrade a lot in Scape and Blight. What is this? Poison Warp? More? Oh, we can get some. Wow, we can get some good units here soon. Warp Lightning Cannons? Oh, we're cooking. Oh, we're cooking. We are absolutely cooking. Ladies and gentlemen, 
We have reached the full cooking phase. These guys seem pretty good down here, but I think we might be able to take them. Because how many settlements do they have? What faction is this? Leoness, right? Lioness? These guys. What news? Wait, do we have 17 or do they have... Oh, their strength... Oh, that's a very high strength rank. How many settlements do we even have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. They have 17 settlements? <laughs> oh, brother. That is not very good. Um... So the bloody hands guys don't really like me. That could be a next target. Just saying. That could be a very viable next target. Is attacking the green skins. Mm, let me actually though, let me cook with that one. Cause think of it this way, right? All their armies are gonna be in the north to start. If we hit them hard to start, so if I attack here, I bring knife on the border there to attack there and once i get stretch up to speed then stretch could attack here and that'd be three settlements gone in one turn and then it would probably just be a sweep after that that might actually not be a bad idea i might be cooking with that one i'm not gonna lie this might be me this might be me cooking this might be me genuinely cooking right now. And if this is me cooking, hey, just saying. Just saying, if this is me cooking, that is nuts. Um, I'm, I'm feeling good though. I'm feeling good. Don't get me wrong. Things could be worse. Things could be a lot worse. <sighs> okay. Um... Yeah, I know that's what I just did. Uh, that's not bad. The control's a big one. We got, we have to do the control. We, ha I'm, I'm sorry, but the control's what's killing us over here. Cottings gaming. It is absolutely murdering us. There we go. We'll get that so we can get rattling gunners and stuff. For wait, Montanus is just a completely different place than Margaritaville. Great one. I thought that they were. Hmm. 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 What do we do here, guys? What do we do? Because I feel like the humans would be a pretty easy attack. I'm not gonna lie. I think we could destroy the humans. But at the same time, the Greenskins—they're not really liking us too much. Can we assassinate this guy? Uh, no, because there's a zero percent chance of it succeeding. Um, how about this? So I'm gonna end turn here. I'm gonna end the episode two when this turn is switching over. So how about this? I'll put out a poll on my YouTube channel, um, probably shortly after this video goes up, on who I should go to war with. One, right? I set up for war with the Greenskins. We attack the Greenskins hard. Two, we go to war with the humans in the south, so that would be like the Bretonian clan, or the Bretonians underneath us. Three, we attack the humans above us, right? Or four, we attack the elves. So that's going to be your options. Those are going to be the four op- wait, was that four? Greenskins, elves, north, south. Okay, yeah, that's four. For some reason, I had five fingers up, even though I was saying four. <laughs> so, yeah, those are going to be your guys' four options. You guys get to dictate what we do next. 
So what you guys think should happen next is what's going to happen next episode. So I'm going to end this off here. So I'd like to thank you guys all so much for watching. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you guys go down below, hit that like and subscribe button. All I'm going to say is you guys know what our current situation looks like. You guys are going to know what you guys want to see in the future of this series. So like I said before, let me know in the comment section down below what you guys want to see. Because what you guys want to see is going to have a lot to say in the next episode. So of course, I will see you all next time. Peace!